Hey everybody, this is Gary, the fist pump go over at Bondi's Toyota Enterprise, Alabama. We just got the 2018 XSC V6 Camry in, it's fully loaded. And I want you to go on the first ride with me because I haven't driven this car yet. Let's go. Okay, we're sitting inside this XSC Camry V6 that we just got on lot. Now this thing's fully loaded, so I won't go over all the features right now. It's more about the drive because I haven't driven one of these yet. Um, but I will tell you it's stacked with standard features and it has optional features that I'll cover at a later time. But I've owned a V6 before. I owned a 2012 V6 Camry. I think it had about 276, 278 horsepower in it. And I want to drive this one to kind of compare those two. I think the torque on this is around 278 foot-pounds of torque and it's 301 horsepower getting about 32 miles per gallon on the highway. So let's take this thing for a ride and see what we think. Now one thing to point out, this is a new drivetrain in this car. Um, it does have the eight speed automatic transmission in it. So it's gonna probably feel a little differently than what I'm used to uh, when I had my uh, uh, 2012 model. But uh, so far so good. This is the XSE. Uh, like I said, you can get the six cylinder XSE and the XLE. It's got, it's very responsive. You know, I noticed that on the four cylinder that the uh, that the four cylinders really rode good and they're real tight, real, real, uh, I wanna say sporty feeling, but uh, really tight when it comes to the handling. So we're gonna hit this light real quick and uh, we're gonna see what it does. Now I noticed that coming through the light, it, it is very responsive on the gas. Like I said, it is an eight speed, so it takes a little time to get used to that. But uh, the acceleration, is uh, really good on it. Um, I don't want to get on it too bad because right now I'm in traffic and I don't want to look at my phone too much. But it would be very hard to uh, uh, know what this car will do without actually driving it because uh, uh, the only real evidence on the exterior to distinguish it between a four cylinder and a six cylinder is the fact that it has a dual quad exhaust, which means it looks like it's got four exhausts back there. But uh, it drives good. It's, it feels like that the uh, uh, acceleration is really responsive and uh, I'm gonna get down the road and we're gonna stop and uh, check out the acceleration right, I'm about to turn around here in the median and I'm gonna get on a little bit just to kind of see how it feels oh yeah very responsive great acceleration on this car um, I was doing 60 in no time I'm not going speed or anything. I don't want to look at my phone too much because I might get criticized for driving and uh, hold my phone up. But uh, I would say that acceleration is noticeable. The torque is very noticeable. The the horsepower is very noticeable, especially when you compare it to the four cylinder and the fact that I've driven a six cylinder uh, old body style before in 2012. Um, this is much peppier and it handles better. I can tell you that. And it's quiet, I mean, it's uh, quite windy outside, so it's fairly quiet inside. But I will tell you that I, I'm, I'm impressed that Toyota did a six cylinder on this car instead of doing a turbo, uh, because I believe overall cost of maintenance on turbos is a, is a little bit higher. And, um, and this one will actually put out a little bit more horsepower than most of the turbos that's coming on the four cylinder. And you know, you can always have a four cylinder turbo go out. Uh, from what I understand. So haven't had much, much experience with the turbos. Um, I know that they do really well um, very early on in the uh, newness of the car and that they wear down over time, probably leaking and stuff. But uh, I would say if you're out looking for a, a good, you know, car that has a lot of horsepower, this V6 Camry is pretty good. Um, I would also recommend the four cylinder because the four cylinder um, has got more horsepower than it did uh, before too at like 203 and it can get up to like 206 uh, on the horsepower and the uh, four cylinder is going to get you about 39 miles per gallon and then this one is going to get you about 32 miles per gallon so it's very comparable to what you would see on most people's four cylinder turbos now and uh, I would definitely recommend it if you're looking for a car with horsepower the V6 Camry, I'm in the XSE right now, is the one you want. So thank you for joining the Fist Pump Guy, selling cars the right way because it's the only way I know. Follow the Fist Pumped Enterprise.